Welcome back to Punta Cana. All you can see, guys. Welcome back. I'm uh, taking a video today from my home office. It's for people that uh, want to move here or already live here and that are interested in gathering their energy from the soul, just like I do. That's why I live here in Punta Cana. We also have our house now on sun energy on solar. We uh, decided to put up a solar system to not only go green, but also save a little bit. And uh, since I am not the one that can explain this very good, uh, Charlie is going to give you the details on what we have and uh, where does it go, where does it come from, where is it saved and uh, what's happening. So this part is Charlie's part and uh, I will find some uh, details that I can read and find and hope to give you good information about our solar system here in Bavaro Punta Cana. Let's go, let's start the video, let's move to Charlie. So guys, we have here now a new installed solar system. The solar panels, they come from Canada. We have six panels, each one with 550 watts. That means we have in total 3.3 kilowatts when the sun is really up. Right now, the angle from the sun, I would say we are charging maybe 30-40%, but this is enough to have to produce the power for the household. And 20 minutes later now, the battery is going to be charged and then we have free power for our air conditions. In Bavaro Punta Cana, we have one electric company and that's private owned Consorzio Electronico Punta Cana Macau, short ZEMP. They have recently built up a field of solar panels too, but mainly run on diesel generators the electricity fluctuates and is not 100% stable, especially when they fire up a generator or lose energy all of a sudden and then start it back up. This has cost us a lot of damage at electric devices already. We are running our power grid through the house now with an inverter. That means we have 24 7 now stable 120 uh, 110 120 or 220 230 volts right now we are paying short 20 pesos local currency for one kilowatt that means in us money it's like more or less 30 us cents I don't know what's your price range back where you are. Compared to the price of the solar system, I think we are done normally in like in three, three and a half years, it's paid for. But also another reason is we had to replace the well pump like until now four times. And this takes always a big action why the well pump is sitting down like 60 feet and to take out the whole tubes and replace it it's always a cost it's starting like more or less in around a thousand dollar and the other equipment what was crashed with the power so i hope now this area ends with the solar system so now you have seen the solar panels and now we're gonna go down where is our inverter and the batteries to show you a quick view over there. Here we are in our maintenance room. Over here you can see here we have our jail batteries. This is each one has 12 volts so together we have 48 volts with 200 amps that means we have a total power of 9.6 kilowatt hours so that means 9.6 with the jail batteries we can use only like and that's what they say like uh, 
70-75%. The rest of the power have to stay in the batteries, otherwise you kill them somehow. Then here we have our inverter. Our inverter here has like 6 kilowatts or 6000 volts. So you can see we are charging already and we were down this morning by 49 point I think one or two or three something like this it's like every day the same now in the winter time so and we can go down till 48 so we have enough power for the whole night through the batteries our consume is right now in between three and a half to four and a half kilowatts so we are actually perfect then over here <coughs> we have a second inverter this is for the well pump this is an inverter with like 3.5 kilowatts and there we have two jail batteries with 12 volts and there is a, a charger a big one where we have run on minimum charge 24 7 to charge this battery but this battery here gives us power to the inverter for the well pump i had i had to divide it why when the well pump starts it consumes like almost three kilowatts so in this one here like i told you has only six kilowatts so when we run during the day on solar like two air conditions and two freezers and the tv and some other equipment so there is like i think we are have more than like 50 percent what we're gonna use or maybe even more three to four kilowatts and when i have the well pump connected then i think there is a chance things gonna explode that's why i want to have it divided so guys that's it for now i hope you enjoyed a caribbean solo video enjoy bye bye that's it from our solar run house now that we have um we don't know too much about it we know what the, the guy that installed it told us and we wrote it down and charlie knows a little bit about it but for him it's a little bit new talking in front of the camera so there are a couple of hiccups maybe in the video please excuse we are very happy that we have uh, electricity now without using our local supplier here uh, as charlie said it's private it's costly if you move here down to bavaro punta cana you don't have a choice there are not many uh, electricity companies electric companies where you can uh, compare prices and see which one you like better it's a uh, temp consorcio electronico punta cana macao or it's nothing uh, sun unless you want to install a wind generator but a lot of people here use solar you can also use solar and put it into the uh, local net and then just get your price reduced. We decided that we want to have uh, electricity for ourselves. We have uh, an intelligent inverter that's so intelligent that even we don't understand it. It should know when uh, the sun is shining that we're using the electricity from the sun. When the sun is gone that we are using the batteries until they're not supposed to be used anymore and then use electricity from the street. But this part we haven't figured out yet. So we just uh, completely shut down the electricity from the street and we're just uh, using solar panel batteries for the night. And for us right now in the winter time works out perfect. So no complaints here, saving a lot of money and hoping that as Charlie said, because we have stable electricity that in a couple of years, uh, the solar system has paid off. Thank you for watching Punta Cana, all you can see. I hope the people that uh, needed to hear this have seen the video and everybody else. Thanks for watching anyway. And <laughs> I see you here. 
in the next Punta Cana All You Can See video. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. La La casa del merengue, la 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 y la casa de la bachata.